All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us here for week 13, correct? Week 13. Of the NFL picks. I'm, of course, Greg Guy, joined here by Mr. Cuz and Mr. Casey. So I'm, I'm just going to hand it over to you, Casey. What, uh, what's the rundown from last week? Last week, uh, obviously, I won. Um, you got to say. It, it, and it, it, by the way, it was decided on the Monday night football game between the Washington Redskins and the Seattle. Washington football team. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> they can be whatever they try to be, but they've been, they were the Redskins for 75 plus years. It's hard to get away from that. How do you feel about the team being called? You asked me this before, and I don't give a shit. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, funny. fuck you for asking that same question twice. <laughs> Fucking How asshole. do you feel about asking me the same question? I don't feel bad at all. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> We're all here just not giving a shit. That's all there is to it. Anyways, next, we got the week 13 picks. Uh, oh, by the way, I had the eight. Uh, guy had seven, and Cuz had six. Overall score, 96. Myself, 99. Uh, guy, and 78. Cuz, so... Uh, well, no, 88, I'm sorry. I, I, was I, I just brought it down. I was like, damn, how did I get that far? I must have <laughs> fucked up the whole week. <laughs> yeah, you scored negative. <laughs> <laughs> it's still highly unlikely you're coming back, though. I, I feel like we should throw him some bones and give him some, like, extra points or something like that. Absolutely. For, I, I, I told you we discussed that, like, week. Right. All right, so let's do the picks for this week. The first game we got uh, starting is Tampa Bay, 8-3 at Atlanta. Five and six. I think there's no surprise here. Tam- All, if not any of us, are going to make. Tam- Do you want to go Atlanta? No. No. Okay. Just check. I'm going to put them there for Atlanta. Just. <laughs> I'm going to laugh my ass off if they won. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm going to pick. I'm going to give them both teams. That way he can't lose. <laughs> He's going to fuck up and let me win here. <laughs> Again. I, I mean, an awesome, amazing comeback would be great for this segment that nobody watches, anyway. All right, next up we got <laughs> Arizona, 9 and Shout out, Don. <laughs> Chicago. Fuck you, King. <laughs> Why are we saying fuck you to King? There's got to be a story. he's the only one who watches it. Oh, he, he watches, watches it on repeat. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's the only reason they have any views. All right. Uh, anyways, Arizona, 9 and 2, Chicago, 4 and 7. Uh, this is no surprise. I'm pretty sure everybody Arizona. here is going to yeah, take yeah, Arizona, Arizona for this one. Next up, L.A. Chargers, Cincinnati Bengals. This should be a pretty decent game. Um, they're at Cincinnati. Cincinnati's been looking pretty decent lately. Um, Joe Mixon's been running all over the place. He's probably top two or three running backs right now. I'm going L.A. L.A. for God. I'm going to go... I'm going to go Cincinnati. I'm going to go L.A. Because it's going to go with L.A. Next up, Minnesota, 5-6 and six at Detroit, 0-10-1. <laughs> uh, I think I pretty much know who everybody's picking here. I don't think there's really any. I don't, I don't even remember who the other team was. All I heard was Detroit, and I was like, yeah, whoever there <laughs> I mean, you would think, I mean, I would hope that they win a game. I mean, I don't put it, like, give it to anybody to lose all the all Has the games. there ever been a team that's lost? Yes, Detroit has done it once. <laughs> Cleveland has done it once. Year. And they're going, they want the record. They want to hold on to the record. Yeah. <laughs> they want to do it twice. Yeah. Well, But also, that's not, this won't be an 0-16 season. This will be an 0-15-1 season. Yeah, so. right. I mean... Is that much better, to be honest with you? But to be winless? Is as, that is that a first? I, they're not tieless, but they're win, winless. I mean, One tie and all losses? Uh, I guess that would be a first. I don't know. There you go. I don't know. That would have to be fact-checked, I think. All right, next up we got Indianapolis, 6-6. Six and six. Houston, 2-9. and nine. Indy. Yeah, yeah, this is another Indy. easy one for everybody here. All right, this one's not so easy. Uh, New York Giants, four and seven. Miami Dolphins, five and seven. Uh, to be honest with you, Miami has looked pretty good the last couple weeks. The Giants won their last game. I do know that. 
Oh, uh, I can't remember who they're playing now. Um, so Cuz is gonna go with the Giants. I'm gonna go with Miami. Yeah, that's that's kind of where I'm at too. Miami. All right. So next up, Philadelphia five and seven, New York Jets three and eight. Philly. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go with Philly also. Concur, Philly. All three of us are gonna go with Philly for this one. There's another game that I'm pretty sure I know who everybody's going to pick. A lot of that going on. Yeah, there's a lot of that this week. Yeah, this is a boring week here. Jacksonville, 2 and 9. LA Rams, 7 and 4. Rams, yeah. All of us are going to go with the Rams. Uh, the, the, I, I do want to head out that the Monday night game should be a pretty decent game. Uh, next up, we got Washington. Five and six, Las Vegas six and five. I think we all bet, uh, said that uh, Las Vegas was going to win last or uh, yeah lose last week. I can't remember who they were playing, but they did win that game. Uh, is that game in Vegas? That game is in Vegas. Mm-hmm. Washington looks. That's a tough one. Washington did look. You know, yeah, good. Washington looked all right uh, this past week against Seattle. But let's be honest, Seattle's Seattle, not yeah. a very good game. Very good team either. I will go Vegas. All right. The game was in Vegas, you said, right? Yes. Okay. Yeah, go. Um, I think I'm going to go Vegas as well. I'm going to go Washington. All right. This is going to go Washington. He's going to catch up right here. This is where he's coming back. He's, this is where it starts. It's starting to come back. Yeah. Next up, Baltimore, 8-3. and three. Pittsburgh, 5-5. Five and five. Baltimore has... Not their offense has not been looking good lately. They've just been squeaking by everybody. Probably the last. And two on top of that, years. a Baltimore Pittsburgh game is always a fucking drag out fight. Yeah, I'm gonna go Baltimore. Cause going Baltimore. I'm torn. I'm gonna I'm gonna go I'm, I'm gonna go Baltimore as well. I'm torn. I'm still torn. Yeah, yeah. they are in Pitt, Pittsburgh. If you want to go Pittsburgh, just because it's a home game, but Pittsburgh. I, mean, I, I haven't I seen know. anything. They tied the fucking Lions. They did tie I go more and more. <laughs> they tied yeah. the fucking Lions. <laughs> All right, next up we got San Fran against Seattle. Are you going to take Seattle for this one too? Or are you going to do two in a row? Because I'm going San Fran. Yeah, I was going to say San Fran. Yeah, no. San Fran. All right. Russell Wilson. Awful at that game too. Uh, this Here's the first uh, football game I watched this year too. By the way, by, by the, the way, I, well, I watched the second. More than likely, uh, Russell Wilson is getting traded this off season, and I I don't know if it's a hundred percent. Well, Russell Wilson wanted to get traded this past off season. Uh, there was a lot of drama going on between that, um, so he wants out, and I'm I'm gonna guess that they probably just want to get see how many picks they can get and try to rebuild that team again. Yeah. Um. Denver six and five, Kansas City seven and four. Kansas City. Kansas City. Look at Denver. Denver. I I, I don't know. I I was I was saying a lot about how much. Kansas City's defense sucks. Uh, I guess they've been doing a little bit better recently. Um, so you're yeah. going Denver? I don't know. Yeah, fuck it. I'm going Denver. I'm going Denver with Cuz. Where the comeback is going full circle. <laughs> right. Next up is the Monday night game. I said this one was going to be a decent one. New England, 8-4. and four, Buffalo, 7-4. and four. Ooh. I know who I'm going to pick, so I'm just going to put my name next to it. Um, they are in Buffalo. Uh, I'm going to go Buffalo. Guys are going Buffalo. Yeah, yeah, I'm going Buffalo as well. Guys going Buffalo. I am going to go with New England. Ooh. So this one, this one, I could, I could, I could make it all the way to tying you back up if, if I win all these this week. It's possible. Uh, next up, Thursday night game. Steelers five five one. Vikings, 5-6. This is like a 50-50 game to me, uh, to be honest. Yeah. 
Um, but I think I'm going to go with the Vikings. Same. This one. Vikings. I'm going to go Steelers. Guys, going Steelers. So, so now, if I get all, if I run the table on you on all these games, I could be in the lead next week. Could be. Unlikely, because that's like four Probably games. Unlikely. I think the I was the probabilities on that are not yeah. very good. All right, but could be still possible. Still possible. That's it. So he's winning the lottery. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I think my probability is a little bit higher. There, my, my probability is a little bit higher on this yeah. than the lottery. Maybe. You play the lottery. <laughs> either way, either way, there we go. Week thirteen of the NFL picks. They're in. Um, I guess we will reconvene next week and see who is still in the lead. Who is still in the lead? Who's still in the lead. Yeah. Ooh, I like. That. Thanks, Thanks for putting that together, there, uh, Mr. Casey. Um, and of course, if Gregor guy also joined here by Cuz. Ladies and gentlemen, you have a wonderful day. Tune in next week to see who wins.